Hello everyone on YouTube, Master Cards here to bring you another trick. But first, I'd like to apologise for like how I revealed the card that we selected from the start in my last video. I looked back and it wasn't fully in view of the camera, so for that I apologise. If you have any complaints about that trick, please leave a comment about it in the description box of the video in question. I welcome any feedback as long as there's no swear words in it. Now enough about that, let's get into this trick. This trick is number 514 in my spell book. It's called the One-Eyed King's Quest. Why is it that? I'll show you. Because I'm going to select my chaser card from the start. I'm selecting it like this to prove I'm not using a set deck. I won't cheat like that. Let's see, let's see. Now here it is. The reason I call it the One-Eyed King's Quest because I'm using the One-Eyed King, the King of Diamonds, because as you can see, it's the, the faces only have one head, eye facing it. There we go. So that will be our chaser card. Now we need to pick a card for it to chase. So I'll just pick one. Let's pick this one. Eight of Spades. You know that one there. Shuffle the deck. Down and lose the bury some of the rest of the deck on top of it, then for the King of Diamonds. Now, since this is called the One-Eyed King's Quest, I'll give it a one-handed cut. Let me try that again. Ha! That much better. And just to show of versatility, I'll do it the other way around. Ooh! That was close. Well, just to prove I can do it. There we go. There. And now, if I just do this. Uh, one, there's our one-eyed king, and did he catch the selection? Yes, he did. That was a close call there, but it worked off in the end. That just shows practice makes perfect. It's one of the oldest things in the book. Well, that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed it. So, until next time, bon voyage.